Welcome back, Buckeye Nation, to your Caribou Daily Science channel. First of all, a big shout out to the three people who watch this video on Friday. Thank you so much for those three views. Okay, now, before we get started, we need to all to remind ourselves, okay, unfortunately, of the of the with a questionable accounting practice for the state of Ohio during the fourth quarter last year and the first quarter of this year, 2021. Because back in February of 2021, this year, the governor's office came out and said that they uh, undercounted deaths, COVID-19 deaths, by close to 4,000 during the fourth quarter. The first thing that's interesting about that report, how do you undercount deaths but not undercount cases? Okay. And the second questionable practice is, rather than going back and fixing those numbers for the fourth quarter, they added them on to February 11th, 12th, and 13th. As you'll see, a massive spike before we get there. Let's take a look at the uh, vaccine report for the state of Ohio. Okay, so you can see that currently the Ohio has administered uh, 23.2 million doses. Of those, uh, 6.1 million have received a single dose, while 5.1 million have been fully vaccinated. Okay. Now let's take a look over at the daily numbers. And what you're going to see is increasing cases and maybe deaths beginning in July. So the question is, are these increasing cases, are these, are, are these because of the variant that's out there? Because if the, if the cause of the variant, then the vaccine wouldn't have pretended in the then the vaccine wouldn't have prevented people from getting this to get the variant out. And that's the trouble, right? At least on theory, at least that's the, that's the story. So here's those three dates, 11, 12, and 13, where they added a close to 4,000 cases on, uh, deaths onto the numbers. And this is what looks like three three weeks with three days beforehand. So this, this, this number here completely blows these first three or four days out of the water, completely throws off the, off the numbers, okay? So anyway, what we do is we come in here and we replace the th February 11th across the 13th with the average number of deaths for those three days. And now let's kind of balance out these numbers a little more. All right. Some summary statistics. The red line represents the, um, the seven-day average. You can see we had a long declining pattern down to, well, wait a minute, July. And now we're seeing numbers starting to increase a little bit in July. Huh, interesting. Look at the course, look at this. So despite vaccinations, uh, so here's the question. Can someone who's been vaccinated still spread COVID-19? Or even more pressing, if you, if you already had COVID-19, does the vaccine do you any good? Anyway, you can see this pattern across you know, two or three different countries. An increase in cases begin to mid-January. So I find, I find that kind of interesting, Buckeye Nation, don't you? Anyway, before I let you go, uh, don't forget to click on that share button, the subscribe button. We'll catch you tomorrow on an updated report.